Okay. So it is Sunday, October 14th, 1984. Just like last time. We're hearing this exactly 34 years later. It has now been three days since the day Stacy broke my heart. Remember, Stacy. If I can't have you, no one can. So now, I have a plan. This plan is something I've been planning out for the past three days. This is a month-long plan that I plan on ensuing tomorrow. Here's the plan. Monday, October 15th. I break into Stacy's locker. And I send her a love note as another person. <clears throat> In the note. I ask her out on a date. By the way, there's a guy that she has a crush on named Trey. I'm gonna make it sound like Trey is asking her out on a date. Hopefully she reads the note. Then, Tuesday, October 16th, Trey arrives outside Stacy's house, which really is just me in a disguise. Trey appears outside of Stacy's house, holding up a giant sign that says, I love you. Wednesday, October 17th. Stacy and Trey meet up after school. They discuss their date plan. For November 15th. <coughs> Thursday, October 18th. Trey calls Stacy, telling him he has sent her money to go out and buy an expensive dress. He asks her to bring a camera so that way she can record the dress that she tits. Friday, October 19th, Trey receives the video of Stacy trying on her dress. Wider than the light. As she undresses from her clothes and dresses herself in the dress. Saturday, October 20th. People always ruin recordings. This is why I don't come outside anymore. It's typical drug dealers nowadays. Horrible. I don't want to see what life will be like in the future. For all we know, in the future, Donald Trump will be the president. Gosh, that would be horrible. Horrible. 
Saturday, October 20th. <clears throat> Stacy brings the dress to school. Stacy brings the dress to school and shows it to Trey. Trey doesn't think the dress is good enough and gives her more money to go out and buy a new dress the following day. Sunday, October 21st. Stacy receives a phone call from Trey. She is asked to once again bring a camera with her to the dress shop to film herself in the dress that she picks. That same day, Trace Stacy almost said Tracy, it's Stacy. That same day, Stacy goes to the dress shop with her camera and records herself as she attempts to buy a dress. However, she's seen with her camera by the store manager, which is really my father in a disguise, and is kicked out of the store. This is where I decided to abandon the idea of going on a month-long plan. Little did Stacy know, I was standing outside undisguised. I will be standing outside undisguised as soon as she opens the doors to leave I lunge grab her by her neck and place a gun to the right side of her temple I force her into the car and lock her in my basement where I then stab her to death Hope you're prepared, Stacy. Sunday, October 21st, 1984. Exactly one week from today will be your demise. And you don't even know it. Have fun, bitch. <laughs>